it's been stressful uh, because there's like a lot, I come into contact with a lot of people. Hannah Lawler is an 18 year old cashier at Winners. During the pandemic, her mask has been her security blanket, protecting her from customers and the unknown. I have no idea where they've been or who they are or anything like that, which that sort of, I don't know, gives me a bit of anxiety because I don't know who, you know, they might have been breaking COVID rules. Now work has become even more stressful. Saskatchewan has plans to lift its masking order, but some frontline workers worry it will be too soon. They're sort of focusing on the adult population because, you know, us teenagers and younger people, we just got our first vaccines. Like, you know, some people just got them this week. The Saskatchewan government has laid out a roadmap for what it will take to remove its mask mandate. They could come off as early as mid-July, but people on the front lines say this makes them a little bit nervous. We must be able to keep an economy clipping along, but we also have to be able to keep people healthy so that those kinds of things can be accomplished. So that's where we always, as registered nurses, as healthcare professionals, want to proceed with, with a very cautious uh, path. The Saskatchewan Health Authority has seen a decrease in strain on the healthcare system in recent weeks, but there is still a burden from COVID-19 patients in acute care facilities. The majority of the people that we see in hospital who are being admitted are becoming critically ill or are dying are unvaccinated. As for some essential workers like Hannah, they hope the province can delay its reopening plan until most people are fully vaccinated. Mickey Judich, CBC News, Regina.